Hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you one simple way of how to make audio crossfade effect in DaVinci Resolve 18. Here I have a basic video clip open with some background music. Now I'm going to go to my media pool and add another audio track to the timeline. So in this tutorial, we're going to crossfade between these two audio tracks. Now the dynamic volume adjusters will not be seen on the audio clip until you increase the height of the audio track. And so in the upper left corner of your audio track, you will see this white slider that we're gonna use later. Now I'm gonna prepare my first audio track for crossfade by sliding the end to this position here. And then I'm going to increase the height of the second audio track over here. And I'm going to slide the second audio track a bit more to the left so they nicely cross over. Okay, so now we're going to fade out the ending of the first audio track by moving this controller. And you can also use this dot in the middle of the curve to adjust the actual curve for the first part of our crossfade effect. Now we're gonna go to the second audio clip by moving the mouse over it. And that's when those controllers show up and move this curve to about here. And this is what allows that gradual increase or decrease of the volume around that spot. So I'm gonna move my playhead over here and test our crossfade effect. Now it kind of worked okay, but I'm gonna make another adjustment by moving the audio track left and adjusting the curve. Now you just have to play around with this crossfade effect and basically play by ear to get it exactly the way you want it. 